Hello everybody, this is Kurt with the Naked Kurt Experience, and we're back playing some Dark Souls 2. Um, so, I was about to record a little bit ago, and then I realized that I... Well, I thought I realized that I didn't have uh, Dukes de Freja's uh, soul, the great soul, to get to the end. But then I realized, yeah, right, uh, I forgot that Dukes de Freja, 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 the, the, the spider bitch, uh, hers isn't a great soul. So I have all the souls, I'm gonna go ahead and take my fancy ants fancy ass over to uh Dream Light Castle now I believe and start getting in the damn bosses and breaking their faces up. But uh yeah, I was gonna record, then I realized I wasn't there and I didn't want to look silly on camera, so I went to go check to see if I forgot it and then I realized that I was being an idiot anyway and I'm gonna have to tell you I was being an idiot. So yay, yay for me being an idiot. Um while I was over there warming up my hands and stuff like that and playing, I uh died a couple times too. It was fun. It was a fun time. We had good times, we laughed, we cried, we insulted each other. It was good. Um, let's see, now where, pretty sure, I'm going to go here. Um, yeah, so the other thing too I wanted to point out as well, I talked about this in Dishonored, um, in the recording for that, and if people didn't watch that at all, I want to put it on here too, just be sure that more people understand. My old headset, which is the Logitech G430s, uh, the inline controls on that died yet again. Um, so on my first pair, the ear cup went out, and then like the microphone was crackling and stuff. On this set, the or on my second set, the same thing was happening, except the uh, sound quality was going out in the ear. Every time I turn up and down the volume, everything would crackle and make really really funny noises and stuff, and it pissed me off. Um, so what I did was I went to the local store where I bought the other headset. I did purchase a uh, warranty for them. Which I typically don't do, but with audio stuff I do, because I always have this kind of issue. And so I returned them, and then instead of asking for the new headset, the same one that I originally would think, oh, it's going to happen again, I replaced them with the G uh, Logitech G930s, because I kept having problems with the line of the headset, so let's get something without a line at all, right? And I, I love wireless. So far, everything's worked fantastically on them. I haven't had any issues like most people complain about with disconnectivity and stuff. The only thing is you cannot up the quality of the microphone. Wow, that was really funny. You can't up the quality of the microphone. Uh, it's running off of 2.4 gigahertz wireless, so it should be able to handle it even though they say it can't. I don't believe them, but regardless, there's nothing I can do about it. The thing is, though, is it's not that bad a quality anyway. Like, it's still, they are true, it does reproduce okay quality just like the G430s did. The only thing that sucks is that using shadow play comparatively to uh, this headset compared to my old headset, the quality of the microphone, it gives this tin effect to my, my voice and this high pitch ring that's almost unbearable to listen to. So I have to use OBS instead. OBS is a very good software as well, but OBS really downplays the recording quality of my microphone like really really degrades it so I sound a lot different than what I used to like just just to give you background um, the last couple um, episodes of Project Zomboid I have been recording with OBS and as you can tell the microphone quality on the G430 was working just fine it was a little bit compressed but for these they, it birches them so until I figured out how to get Shadowplay to not give that high pitched tin quality effect to these headsets you're going to have to deal with it being a little bit dimmer but I'd rather you hear me and it sound good than you uh, hear that and be upset with it being all grindy noise and high pitched tin crackle noise you know so I don't know why I ran through that but I, I just kind of wanted to do something while I was talking through that so you guys didn't get bored of me just standing around talking while going like this like most most people playing Dark Souls if they're explaining something they'll go like this and run in a circle for a while I do the same thing we all do it just one of those while talking and standing in, in place but yeah so, case in point, um, case in point, I mean, uh, to sum it up then, uh, lower quality sound with the OBS on the microphone. Recording is the same though, so the video quality is still the same, which is nice. That was a mistake. Uh, so the only thing I have to do is just figure out when I get a chance how to correct the crackling sound in Shadowplay. So if anybody has any way to solve that, then go ahead and feel free to let me know. Otherwise, I'm going to have to figure it out. And yeah, I could get a uh, actual like microphone stand and get an actual good mic, but money and stuff. And yes, well, you had money to get the headset. Well, 
I returned my old headset and then I got these new ones on sale, so I didn't really have to spend anything different. So I just don't have the money for a microphone. Um, and a headset was a very good alternative at the time when I did have the money to get an actual upgrade from what I was using, which was not very good. Yay! So, just case in point. Um, now it is a case in point. I just have to worry about that kind of stuff. Right now, the microphone quality not being good. Just have to fix the things in Shadowplay. Hopefully I can upgrade the quality a little bit, and then maybe sometime down the road if I ever get enough, I'll be able to... Uh... Oh yeah, this is the DLC. I don't want to do the DLC. <laughs> If I can ever get enough um, saved up for it, maybe get a new microphone. I know they're not very expensive. It would upgrade the quality greatly, but for now, I'm sorry I can't do that. <laughs> Wish I could. Back to the game, shall we? Well, here we are. Let's go to Drang Lake Castle and kill bitches and stuff and be murdered. And I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? Yep, yes, thank you. Thank you, Brain. You're always a trooper. I don't know how you've managed so many uh, head injuries and still maintained practicability and... Uh, Mild intelligence, I mean, I'm somewhat of an idiot, so that does speak for itself. Oh, hey, it's the High Knight, yay, let's kill him, yay. I'm just going to come over here first, grab my booty. Ooh, repair. See, that's uh, kind of a good thing, though, if you get one of the uh, rings that gives you attunement and you have just enough to use that, Repair would actually be a very good one to use if you're not really magically inclined like I'm not in this game. I don't really prefer using magic um, in the initial stages. Oops, I missed that completely. Later in the game, if you want to get farther in the game and actually do pretty good on like higher, higher tier, like NG plus 2, 3, 4, 5, magic is more viable in terms of uh, what they call cheesing. You know, just shooting things from a distance and not getting anywhere near them. While melee isn't very easy, but you can still do it. Where is it? Hide lands. Eh. So, just my personal recommendation, if you want to do NG++++ and stuff like that, magic is actually a very, very viable way to do it because you can get really, really overpowered and blow through it, but you're also glass cannony, so like, if you get hit, most anything kills you in one hit anyway if you're above NG plus two or whatever. Um, if you're going melee by con comparison, make sure that your uh, agility is up high enough where you can have enough iframes to roll through anything in the game. Because pretty much anything above plus plus is going to pretty much one shot you. So just take that into consideration if you are going to consider going to higher levels. It's it's not really that fun as a meleeer, unless if you're really good at dodging. Which, as you can tell, I am not. Well, not when I haven't played for well over a week in this game. So maybe that's the reason, too. Make sure that you've, uh, you know, just make like a second character next to your NG+, plus whatever you're at. Make a secondary character next to him, and then play through the beginning of the game again with your first character. And then you'll be able to get enough practice in that you're no, you're not being sluggish like I am and screwing up all your attacks and stuff. Then you'll be good when you go into the plus seven or whatever you're at. This Hold on. But nonetheless, to bring an end. Please talk to me. All right, here's the fun part. I gotta fight the two mammoths. I gotta fight all the jerks shooting at me. Actually, do I have a bow? I know that I don't want to use bows, but. But 50, 65, 188 for a crossbow. Do I have any crossbow bolts? Yes, I do. I would never usually use a crossbow in this game either, but I have them. Oops. The reason why I'm doing this is because hopefully, damn it, his soul came to me. You can get the, uh, Shots from over here, kill these guys right away, and then spawn, or not spawn, open the door from way back here before you have to go through all the other fighting. Please go into that. Please go into that. Yes! Alright, I only have to kill one thing over there now, which is good. Hey, go ahead and spawn. Yay, you guys are cool. Swing at me.
Oops. I am fat rolling. I am fat rolling. And I missed. Oops. Come on. Come on, gay. Sorry about the bad camera views there. I know that I was kind of just sticking the camera right up the freaking elephant's butt, so to speak. And done. I remember when I first played this too, uh, I could not figure out for the life of me how to open these doors, and I couldn't also figure out why the hell everything out here kept respawning to kill me over and over and over again. This isn't a fake, is it? Nope. Sweet. Could be trapped, though. It's not. Good. Now where, where are these jerks? Come on, I need them to spawn. Hello? I need some spawns, bro. No, don't go to me. Don't go to me. Ah. Go to them. Yeah, there we go. Oh, Royal Greatsword. Not bad. <laughs> so there you go. Oh, jeez. There's nothing back here, is there? I'm just being silly, aren't I? Yep. See, and that's where they come out of. That's where they spawn. Hey, buddy. Who are you? And by who? This castle. His Highness. You do you see unfortunate? Do you know you're dead? Queen. My lord, he fang, our king, King Fang. The king long of she the king. Okay. The king with to sell. Okay. The queen, the peace, the dark. The queen, the peace, the dark. You're dead. Like. Welcome, Argy. Tell me. Thank you, jeez. My lord. I think that's it. But, but yeah. This, where, who are you? By who? He has a flamberge and a lucerne and a bracing knuckle ring. Uh, lightning bolt. Old radiant life gems, divine blessing, and a great magic oh, barrier. Be safe. Thanks, bro. Woo! <laughs> I think I'm gonna go to the looking glass night first. Although I'm taking my sweet time, so this is not going to be a fun amount of time to... Oop. Nah, nah, nah. Nah, brah. This is my rodeo. Because I still have the Looking Glass Knight, I have the uh, Dragon to defeat, I have Vendrick to kill at some point once I get to that. I have the uh, Giant Lord, I have... Oh god, there's a couple... Why couldn't you have stood closer to him to let him let yourself die with him? Hello? 
This seems rather strange that there's just like nothing in that room. I don't remember if there's anything special you can do in there or not, but um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh wait, I can go up into the. Nah, screw it. I'm wasting time. Hey, buddy. Ouch. Didn't think you could reach me. Bye! <laughs> Boom. Boom, shiki leaky. I didn't want to say shock lock, so I said shiki leaky. Climb. Climb, mine thrun. Whee! Alrighty. Now for these hallways. I don't think these guys spawn in here, but these guys in here do. Forgot two door. You can't roll through the double doors. I want to open this first because I want me some uh, bonfire. Yeah, I'll just leave it like that. There's the way to the end. It's where you beat the game. That's where you kill Nashandra. Oops, missed. Don't hit me again. Now I know I don't want to go in here. Does he come back out? No, not yet. Okay, good start, good start. Breaking all your shit. Breaking all your shit. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> I want to go in all the other rooms too, but I know for a fact that they're not fun because they have the Royal Knights in them. The Ruin Sentinels, actually, whatever they're called. Those guys. The one who just ran past. Ow. Well, I screwed that up. Ow. I'm gonna die! No! <laughs> he did his uh, combo. That's my mistake. But that's okay, that's. I deserve a death once in a while. I mean, come on. I did such a good run through the other parts of that, too. I also, at one point, I was considering. I, I It's gonna hurt if I say this, but. Because I don't wanna, like, guarantee that I'm gonna do it. But I might actually do a uh, deathless run to get the ring to make my thing invisible one of my weapons my left-handed weapon or whatever it is cuz you only get that ring if you beat the game without uh, dying once which is a problem in itself hey buddy come on let's 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 dance let's let's boogie to it whoa there <laughs> whoa well oh, that we were friends boy Oops, I got greedy. And he hit me through an iframe. In reality, I'm actually just not rolling like I should be. Drink. And I'm doing this because I want to get the stuff out of each of these chests on top of the extra... Uh, souls too, because leveling is always a good thing for me. Mastodon Great Sword. I think, if I remember correctly, the Mastodon Great Sword is actually pretty good. Yeah, it's a B and an E ranking with 30. So, like, I'm pretty sure if you upgrade it, it gets to S as well. Thank you. Oh, jeez. Hi. <laughs> Oops, I missed him.
I'm just gonna go ahead and take out my shield again, because I knew that I was gonna do that. Oh, he broke my poise. Or not my poise, my stamina. There we go. He dead. Boite, he dead. And yes, I am gonna try to go out of my way to get the uh, sconces lit up in this room, because I like it when it's bright actually in here, so I can see what I'm doing. Royal Surger's Ring plus fun. I the only second dragon ring on. Wow. Does this give me more? It does. But the other one gives me so much more HP, stamina, and maximum load. I'm just going to stick with what I got. It's what I got. No, don't go to the door. Damn it. Oh. Go to him. Thank you. Oh, hello. <laughs> Didn't expect you to come out of your hole right away. Jeez. Ugh. Got me on the backswing. Boom! Oops, missed, and he's gonna poke me. You get greedy, you get the axe to the face. Okay, that drops through the hole in the ground. Oops. Oops, twice. I don't want him behind me, I'm sorry. Some of these guys, though, like his attacks and anything like that, the, the speed at which he hits. See, if you get hit, like, I'm blocking way too late. No, that's not going to go to the door. If you block too late, he'll uh, hit right through it, and then he'll keep attacking so you can't... Oopsies, I'm not going to get the other door open. Oh, well. He'll just keep attacking through everything, and it just kind of sucks. Come here, buddy. I need you to open the final door. Get your fat ass out of there. And yeah, I'm being uh, completely unsafe and I'm just trying to get through this quick because I have the thing right there. Who cares, right? Well, unless if he kills me, then... Then you'll just look like a doof. Now go go to. Th Thank y'all. I'm just gonna drink. Get the last rune sentinel out here. Come on, buddy. I didn't try to block there, but I was still holding the button while I was passing him, and so <laughs> instead of getting the roll off, I just kind of screwed that. Oops. Oh god. Brain. Work with me here, buddy. Okay. Nearly died. That's that's fine. I'm not really that worried about it. Because now I can do that. Get a feral slock stone. I still have to go ahead and kill the Royal Rathorty and stuff. Damn it, I didn't want to do that. Is there anything in here? No? No secret walls or nothing? This is just a, uh, your stupid one? I think it is. Um, I'm actually going to gamble, because I'm pretty sure if I fall down this pit over here, it takes me to another bonfire. So I'm just going to go ahead and try. Uh, I think it does. Faran stuff. Yep, there's the bonfire. Whew. I didn't stupid. Thank God. <laughs> Man, I'm taking forever, and this is only just the beginning. I have to go kill the mirror. Uh, looking glass snake. That's what it's called. Hail, man. You have the 
I am Dark Diver Grandal. Grandal. Seeker of if you well then. Nah. Mm. No, no. Young undead. May the dark shine your way. If you can't see nothing, you can't see nothing, right? But yeah, okay, so there we go. I'm under Drang Lake Castle. I need to go back to Kingsgate. Then I have to run directly to the right and avoid all the jerks in the room again, which is the only thing that sucks about doing that, but I really wanted to get everything out of there and I wanted to open those paths. So I know that I could have just done the two, but I like getting everything. Okay. Hey, buddy. You're gonna actually come in here? Yeah, you are. You're gonna be that guy. See, this is one of those games too, though, that you can seriously just cause more problems for yourself than they're worth. Like, I just kinda wanna kill him again. But I know if I keep screwing around with him, he's just gonna kill me. Or I'm just gonna waste so many Estus, I'm gonna have to go back and do it again. So let's just leave him alone. He won't follow me up these stairs. He can't fit. He's too fat. Is this where the... Oh. <sighs> every time I play this game, every freaking time, that guy scares the crap out of me. I'm like, oh my god, okay, never mind. That's... <laughs> so, if I remember correctly... Oh, this area. Oh, no. Jeez, I forgot about this area. This is going to take me a while, and I feel bad now. I don't want to make this like an hour and a half video. Is this the spinning room? Yep. Yeah. Oh god, I'm poisoned. Let me just do that. Where are the things to chew on? They're there. See, if you're fast about it, you're good, but I wanted that Twinkling Titanite, just in case if I do change up my weapon later. Twinkling Titanite, it's paramount for any devil weapons, essentially. Demon weapons. Oh god, I can't see if I'm walking down the stairs proper. Alright, that worked out a lot better than I thought it would have. Hey, dude. That was cute. And then I get hit three times by him. Like a stupid. So then I look like a jerk. Thank you for Science Helm. I've never gotten those parts. Oh boy. Oh, I forgot about that. That was almost bad. <laughs> God, I'm stupid sometimes. I don't remember if there's anything you can do with that other than just get friggin' cursed. Nameless usurper. Let down your long hair. And I missed. And I got hit, and I got hit. I can't remember. I think the Nameless Usurper is up here somewhere, right? I can't remember, though. I'm gonna go down and kill this little bastard. Okay, there's that up there. There's this over here. You missed. 
<laughs> Your aim is bad and you should feel bad. Oh my god, it's like I knew that was there. I did. Let's go up and kill that nameless usurper now. Eventually I'll read about the backstory of the game again and then actually learn all the uh, ins and outs and like who the actual nameless usurper is. I used to know all that stuff, but I don't remember anymore. Where is the nameless usurper? I thought I had to fight him. You have fought admirably on your journey, cursed undead. I am Nishandra, Queen of Drang Lake. A true monarch, the last king of this land. He found the strength to rule. He found more, but in the end. Yay. Visit Vith. We have... Just like anybody in high power. As soon as they stop talking to you, that means go away, please. Oh yeah, he's up here, isn't he? No, where's the nameless usurper? I want to fight him. I want to kill him. I'm trying to remember where he is, but I can't. I'm not gonna lie. And I know he didn't die, because it didn't give me... What? What was that? It didn't give me the marker that said he was vanquished back to his world. Or banished back to his world, I mean. So where in the devil did he go? What? Is he in here? Oh, there you are. <laughs> There we are. My mistake. Could have just went down the stairs instead of running in a big fucking loop, but that's that's how I play. Oh. Do I have enough life gems just to full up right here so now I can just go to the boss right away? I think I do. Hey. Oh wait, the twin dragon riders too. Forgot about these guys. I gotta get him to knock him down. Thank y'all. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, I thought I was blocking that one. Uh oh. Let's just go ahead and take that shot to the back. <laughs> Now it's going to be easy. Like, I was actually kind of... Bad playstyle there, Kurt. No, I thought it was going to be easy, but I wound up killing myself. Because I rolled too early. I apologize, everybody. That was me. This episode is just full of me failing. Failing, failing, failing. Like, what is wrong with me today? Uh, do I have any lightning anything? Dark, rotten, charcoal? No, of course not. Of course not, I do not, I do not. Do I? I do not. Oh well. Let's just go kill him. Hey buddy. I had that fight too right at the end there and I just kind of screwed it up.
What? Pretty sure. I'm gonna go back and look. I'm pretty sure I was holding the friggin' block on that part, but. Oh well. I keep forgetting that there are people in between me and up here again. So I keep, like, trying to run past everything. Which I could. I mean, it doesn't really matter. I don't need to kill them, but I have, like, this urge to. Lock, please. Thank you. There we go. He's dead. I rolled backwards when he was poking. Between the two, though, the uh, <clears throat> the arrow, bow and arrow, ranged dragon rider. This, this fight isn't really hard because the, the ranged dragon fighter, if you don't know about... Oh crap, he broke my... If you don't know about the ranged dragon rider, uh, if you don't break him off that pedestal, he'll just stand up there and keep shooting until like you do enough damage to knock him down or something, or kill this guy off. Or after a certain point, I think, too. But if you knock him down, he's the weaker of the two. So, like, it, as you see, it only took a couple melee hits to kill him. Uh, but you want to kill him off because he's just a nuisance in that fight if you don't do it. So that's why I go, I go ahead and I break that down to knock him off right away and kill him first. Well, there's that fight, so that's the boss. I'm going to go to the Looking Glass Knight the next episode, I believe. Oh, good to see you well. Next. I journeyed from the distant. The legend has it. A sword. Spin him. I'm a fish. This one. King's blunt. Loop it. So what I'll do is I'm going to cut the episode off right here and then I'm going to record one right after this and get to the next episode and kill the Looking Glass Knight right away. So thanks guys for watching. We'll see you in the next one.